I don't want to have a so-so faith, a faith that believes and yet really expects disaster to happen. You'd be surprised how many people believe that way. It says in Psalms 139, verse 7, Whether shall I go from thy spirit, or whether shall I flee from thy presence? It means, it's a question, it means there's nowhere I can go where you're not with me, God. And if I realize this, no matter where I go, or what I face in life, that you are with me, well, then my life changes. God's Spirit is always with you. And you meet change in your life, not with fear and dreading, but by expecting good. When you expect good, that is, that's real faith, not so-so faith. Because you realize that your security is in God. You can view changes and adjustments in your life as opportunities for brand new blessings. I've had changes in my life and, and they were difficult at the time. But I tell you, walking forward with God and allowing God to go ahead of you, they turned out to be literally the greatest blessings I've ever had. And it will be so for you. Your security and my security is anchored in the realization that no matter where we are, no matter where we go, God is with us. And therefore, we expect to experience the fullness of God's love, the fullness of God's guidance. The quiet remembrance of God as our security it stabilizes us. It stabilizes our thoughts. It stabilizes our feelings. God's strong, abiding, changeless spirit is with us and within us. And we accept life's changes and fluctuations with an expectation of good Believing and accepting that good is in store, we are able to venture into new experiences prepared for happy and fulfilling outcomes. We become alert to and we make use of the spiritual resources that God has given us. I pray today that God's Spirit is with you always. I pray even more that you realize this, you remember this every moment. And I pray that you meet change by expecting good.